We did. Snowflakes were now back to this kind of sleety stuff that's bouncing off my hand, Antoinette. But let's talk for a moment about these Fitchburg Hills. This one behind me is Granite Street. It is treacherous on any day, especially today. It's always a good day when there's snow and ice. <laughs> Spoken like a plow guy, though hard to prepare when downpours wash away salt, creating ponding on the roads. So when the temperatures dropped below freezing and the rain changed over right around the first break of day, the salt came out. It was a shovel and throw on sidewalks at the mall at Whitney Field and Lemonster and spread as you go from trucks along Route 2 in Fitchburg. That telltale spitting and popping of sleet rolled in after 7 a.m. Not ideal, though timely because it prevented that thin, invisible, icy glaze from developing due to freezing rain. You could see what you could scrape. It still didn't make it easy to walk around. Schools are closed today in Fitchburg, one of the first districts to call it, and even experienced drivers had to take care. Not too bad yet. They're getting bad, though. You know, some of the some of the good old Fitchburg hills are getting challenging. We know what he's talking about. It is steep and slippery. To help stop that slipping on steps, Caitlin with Hometown Pros is working on her change-up on a day with constant changeover long before the first sign of spring. It's just like a grab and a toss sideways, just right down, right where you want it to go. <laughs> sort of like you're tossing seed. Oh boy, I'm afraid it's going to be a little while until we're tossing seed. And it's only expected to get a little bit colder today. One more look at these hills. I will tell you, there have been cars going up and down this hill. Fortunately, no one's been spinning out so far. Again, it is getting a little bit colder, though, throughout the afternoon. We're live in Fitchburg. Josh Brogadier, WCVB News Center 5.